let's understand one more scenario based on screen flow so in this scenario i'm going to create a related case on account record and this time we need to launch screen flow through quick action so let's understand how it will be implemented so clicking on new flow so that i can create a flow from here i'm selecting screen flow so if you want to launch any flow from quick action so that quick action will be created on the record page and uh, if you open particular record so that records id will be available automatically inside the flow so first of all i am going to create a variable as record id so this record id should be as is like record id so i should be capital and everything else should be in small data type text available for input because uh, this record id variable will be receiving input outside from outside the flow now i am going to implement the screens so enabling screen as case information now i am just jumping to the case tab and if i create new case so you can see two fields are required status and case origin and both are pick list so it means we need to fetch these pick list values into flow so first i am going to fetch status so here i am dragging and dropping this pick list component so labeling it as status it will be required from the ui and here i am going to create new choice resource as pick list choice set naming it as case status object as case data type is pick list and api is status and done so this way uh, this pick list component is linked with the case status pick list now we need to link one more pick list that is case origin so here i am labeling it as case origin required and again we need to create new choice resource as pick list choice set so object i am selecting as case data type as pick list field as case origin and done so this way both the pick lists are available on the screen now i am clicking on done now i need to select the element as create record so create case how many records to create one then use separate resources and literal values so here object i selected as case now i need to assign the selected pick list values to the fields which are available under case object so this is the case object field that is status and we created a status pick list component as well on the screen so you need to pick this screen component because it will be having the selected pick list value then add fields and here you will be adding the case origin so here you can see uh, the screen component is like case origin so we need to select this now if you want to link your case with account so on case we have this account id lookup we need to populate it with this record id so this record id will be having the value automatically so whenever you place your screen flow on any quick action so when you click on that quick action so it will automatically provide the record id into this record id variable so i clicked on done now i am saving this flow so create case on account i am saving it and activating it now i just need to move to object manager i am opening account object then here you will find this option button links and action so from here you just need to click on this new action button and you need to fill these information so from here you need to select the flow then here you can see we have this create case on account flow so i am selecting it 
label i am label i am giving it as create case through flow sorry case through flow and saving this so this quick action is created now i am just moving back clicking on this button links and actions again and here you will find this action right now if you want to see this action on the account record page so you need to go to page layout so you just need to check the page layout assignment which page layout is currently being in used so for i'm just logged in as system admin profile for system admin this account layout is used so you can click and open this layout now here you just need to select this mobile and lighting actions scroll up and here you will find the button like case through flow and you can just drag and drop it click on save so your page layout is getting saved right now after doing this backend configuration you can go to the ui so now if you open any account record so on that account record page you will find this quick action so right now i am on this account that is test so here this button is available if i go to any other record let's say flow account 1 so here also this button is available and you can see cases are zero right now so i am clicking on this button so as i clicked on this button so this uh, record that accounts record id uh, is automatically passed to our flow record id variable it will be receiving that id automatically and that you will realize when this case will be automatically related to this account so i am just selecting the case status and case origin and clicking on next and here you can see a case is automatically related to this account so this is happening because we are using record id variable in the flow and that record id variable is receiving the account id automatically now if i go to any other account so here also you can see cases are zero so if i want to create one more case here so it will be created and it will be linked as well okay so this way i demonstrated you how to create a screen flow and how to place that screen flow uh, on a quick action so, or you can say how to launch the screen flow through quick action and you need to place the quick action on a particular objects page layout 